Welcome to Marbles on Stream, an interactive game where you can race marbles against your friends on Twitch. In this video, I will explain how to set up a local leaderboard for your stream on Twitch. What is a local leaderboard, and why would you need one? A local leaderboard is a fantastic tool for streamers who want to give out prizes to their viewers or for running an event. You can use a regular 16 race grand prix to track results, but if you want to save the results or if you want to conduct more than 16 races, then a local leaderboard is necessary. How do you set up a local leaderboard? From the home screen, go to leaderboard at the top and then click local. The first thing you want to do is check the box next to Enable, and then click Settings. Next, click the box for Use Custom Points. If you don't use Custom Points, then overall Season Points will be used for your leaderboard. If you notice, you have five different tabs that you can create Custom Points on. If you have not created Custom Points yet, then the first slot will be blank. For tutorial purposes, I will use the second slot to demonstrate. After selecting the slot you want to create points on, you need to set your participation points and the point offset. The participation points will award the viewer points for every race they join, even if they don't win. The point offset will determine the offset between places. Here, for simple settings, I have set the participation points to 0 and the point offset to negative 1. You can change these values to make the leaderboard more interesting and unique to your own stream. The next thing to do is to add our first place. For this basic leaderboard, the first 300 marbles playing will be awarded points, so I will give 300 points to the first place. If you need more or less spots, you can change this number. Then you will click the plus sign until you have 300 spots. You can see the point offset working because it's subtracting one from each place as the spots are added. Now that we are done creating the point structure, you can click the X button to exit out of that menu. Now you need to create a new session. If you haven't set up a local leaderboard before, you won't have any sessions created. Click the new session button, add a name, and this will be your local leaderboard. Make sure you check the Enable box if you would like your leaderboard to be active. This leaderboard will track points and races as long as you have it enabled. And you can enable multiple leaderboards at once. You can combine the results of the leaderboards by clicking View next to the two different leaderboards. You can only combine a maximum of two leaderboards. If you would like to display the top three winners on a podium for all to see, just click the Podium button and a special podium screen will be shown. Keep in mind that you can sort your local leaderboard results by clicking on any of the different categories. You can also include tilting in your local leaderboard by clicking the box on the tilting screen next to Add to Local Leaderboard. Another option for streamers to capture results is to use the Copy to Clipboard button. At the end of each race, you can manually copy and paste your results into a spreadsheet or document by clicking Copy to Clipboard and pasting into the desired program. Thank you so much for watching this video. Feel free to leave a comment if you have any questions about leaderboards. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel for more Marvels on Stream content.